Sorry, take that back. <laughs> Welcome back to Vlogtober. It's about 9.40 a.m. I had to like set an alarm for 9 and uh, get up because I went to bed late last night. As you know if you watched yesterday's vlog, but literally for three hours my title was wrong. <laughs> That's what happens when you upload a video really late and you're tipsy. Um, yeah. Anyway, I'm going to start getting ready and I seen that. Shane's new episode is out with Jeffree Star. <laughs> I've been waiting for this since he announced it yesterday, so I'm gonna watch that while getting ready. Hey, makeup finished. I decided to go a little bit more feminine today with this black headband and this kind of like a see through blouse. Okay, so you can really see in this mirror more of what I'm wearing. So I have the GU blouse on that's see-through um, and then I have like a bodysuit underneath. I'm wearing this velvet headband and then I have my wide leg white pants on because honestly I wanted to wear leather pants with this but I think it's too hot for leather pants I might die. Whatever I decided to change to leather pants last minute. <laughs> Oops! We're gonna squeak the whole day. I met up with Emily. Hi. How cute is she? Oh, thank so you. Cute. You look cute too. Huh? Thanks. <laughs> but we're going to do some like Halloween desserts at a hotel. Do you remember the hotel's name? Hotel Miwa. 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 Yeah. I can't remember the restaurant's name. Now. It's all right. It's all right. I've never really been in this area of Tokyo before, like ever. I don't know where I'm going, so we're just gonna oh, look. There's a sign right there. Ah, okay. Uh -huh. Oh, there it is. Hotel Miwa Tokyo. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And. I think it's like 3,000 yen for this. Oh, something's going on. What something is going on. This is where we are, Hotel Niwa Tokyo. Let's go. Yeah. Let's get it. I'm excited because I'm slightly hungover. <laughs> I feel like that's the story of my life. I'm slightly hungover. <laughs> yeah, like every Saturday if I go out Friday. Although this month I've been pretty good. Um, this is like, like yesterday was the first Friday that I've gone out in like a really long time. It looks so nice though. I don't know, over there. Fancier than I thought. How come they already have a Christmas course? So this is where we are going, dining Liu, I guess. And it looks really nice inside. <gasps> they have a buffet. Get out of here. Oh yeah, they have a salad and bread buffet. <gasps> oh, no. oh, and it looks so cute inside. It's so orange and very fall. Hey Emily, we're going in for the salad bar. Yeah, because there's and the drink bar. Look at the bread. <gasps> bread. Look at the cheese thing. Oh my god, oh my god. It's fate. The cheese is right behind me. <laughs> okay, we're at this dining area and the deal is actually really good. We get this whole course. The you got to the October course and the dessert is the Halloween one. And um, I thought it was only gonna be dessert for 3,000 yen, but actually it's a whole course for 3,000 yen, which is like a great deal. I'm hungry, I'm hungover, I'm ready. <laughs> Emily, we have no chill. No, we don't. No chill. This is my lunch. I think I got like a roast beef kind of dish. Emily got fish. It looks super cute. How cute is this? I love that like the powder is a bat, the jack-o'-lantern. He didn't say what kind of ice cream it was. Vanilla ice cream's good. It's like a French vanilla. I'm curious about the purple ice cream. What is that? Ooh, is this grape? It's grape. Huh. So I thought it would be like purple sweet potato. Which is sack or taro or whatever. Mm. Oh, it's great. It's pretty good then. Yeah, I've never had like grape ice cream like that. Yeah, I've had a sherbet, but this is like straight up ice cream. Mm -hmm. It's good. It's not a very sweet mm -hmm. dessert, but it's good. Is it pumpkin? Yeah. It's pumpkin, but it's not like you know sometimes pumpkin's so sweet? Yeah. It's like a subtle pumpkin flavor. 
That was really good. We're just gonna head out soon. Um, it's like two. We got here at 12. That was really good. Did you like it? Yes, and it was such a good deal too. So good. It's like all you can eat, salad, bread, coffee, and then we had the main course. Yep. And then the delicious dessert and with everything included, it's 3,000 yen. That's service charge and tax. Like everything. everything. 30 zalas. That's it. That's such Perfect. a good deal. After like last night, paying 25,000 yen. <laughs> Not only me, but like split between three girls. Still. I was like, <laughs> I'm hurting. <laughs> like, I'm a cheap. Not cheap, but like, you know, I like a deal. I'm cheap. <laughs> well, okay. We like deals. Actually, around this area, I saw that there was like some kind of amusement park. I kind of want to like see it if I can. Um, and they have like a big carousel, so yeah. What's this What's this area? Do you remember the station? Um, this is Suidobashi. Suidobashi. It's really, really close to Tokyo Dome. I wonder if it's always this high. I mean, it looks pretty though with all like when all the leaves change here, ooh, ooh. So yeah, you can see the little station name there, Suidobashi Station. Um, guys, you can see the amusement park. Ah! I wonder if you can pay by ride. Can you walk around though? Whoa, I haven't been to an amusement park since like maybe USJ seven years ago. I feel like I'm a kid again. And um, this is a great date spot, just saying. Throwing that out there. T if you're watching. Date. Whoa. There's like three people on my room. <laughs> I feel ripped off. There's no horses on this carousel. All I saw was like the top from the station. Right? I feel ripped off. I'm curious how much this one is, the parachute ride. So you can pay per ride and this one's called the Sky Flower and it's 650 yen. Okay, we got the tickets. We're gonna ride the Sky Flower. Um, let's go. Oh no, I'm dying. Oh dang! <laughs> <laughs> you said you're scared of heights? I am! Oh my god. It only goes so 60 tall. meters. It only goes 60 meters. I got him. Hi, so this. Uh, I can't film, so see you on the other side. I love that little girl who just did it. We're like, that was so fun. Know, <laughs> We're over here like, <laughs> like, like, okay, 60 meters. I, I was like, Emily, it's only 60 meters. Uh, I would take that back. <laughs> it's a lot taller yeah. than it looks, okay. Emily's like, don't look, I'm not gonna look down. I look down, I'm like, don't look down. I regret it, I regret it. And our hands were like clammy. clammy. Oh. And we could totally see that there is a concert or something yeah. going over there because um, it's just like a swarm of people. Looked like a zombie outbreak. I like that we just walk this way, but we don't actually. Know. No, where are we going? <laughs> oh, uh, oh, this is nice. oh, it's like a yakiniku place. <gasps> so now Starbucks released this new drink, and you can get these holders with it. I think you might have to pay extra for it. I'm not sure, but they're cute. And I'm just like looking at the matte black things, like I want it. I want it. The plastic. Like, they crack. I don't think they're hot. But you can I put it in my dishwasher and it cracks. But like, the Halloween stuff is cute. The fall stuff is also cute. Emily's getting that shot. Yeah. Get it. It's cute. It is cute. <laughs> and I got the pumpkin tart and coffee frappuccino. We have a fantastic view of the roller coaster <laughs> and people screaming their lungs out like coming down here and going all around coming back here. I'm gonna try the drink, Emily's gonna let me. You have to hold it like a sippy cup. Oh there they come! <laughs> I can't hold it like a sippy cup. 
pick up. I'm just gonna. Oh, it's good. Yeah. 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 It's like a dessert. It's like it's almost like a milkshake. Yeah. With a little bit of vodka in there. <laughs> We're gonna go into the huge Don Quixote, and I'm gonna look at some of the Halloween stuff. Oh my god, these candies are eyeballs. It's a gel that dries into a patch so you can put makeup over it. Oh my god, it looks so good. Whoa, I've never seen this one. Mint yogurt. But, <laughs> but look, they have like Oreo, um, I can't even, cereal. That's yes. what I'm looking for. They have Oreo cereal. Oh my god. $14 for one box. Wow, their Halloween section's huge. <gasps> There's a kitchen mask. You can get face stickers and you can get like rainbow tears. Huh. Interesting. Oh, they have blood spray now. This costume is called Bloody Little Girl. Um, okay. I like like the names of some of these. Club Queen. Home now and T and I are going to be watching what is it? Ireland and New Zealand play and it's I'm sure it's gonna be a good game. I don't like rugby. Well like it's not like I don't like rugby. I enjoy watching it sometimes, but oh they're gonna do the haka dance. Do you think he's the captain? Maybe. Here I am on my apartment floor, woo! I'm just waiting to make a thumbnail for the vlog because T's using the iPad to play games. So I have a bag here because you guys seen that I stopped into Don Quixote and actually that Don Quixote location had like very few Halloween things so if I wanna get anything for Halloween I should probably hit up the Yokohama store and not that one. But um, yeah, I did get a few things from Don Quixote and I wanna share with you guys what I got. I already opened this because I wanted to use it. I got lotion. <laughs> Exciting. I got a little tiny portable one that I can throw into my purse and just go throughout the day. This is Vaseline. I've had a Vaseline hand lotion in a long time. And then I decided to get peanut butter from there. The GIF kind. I think this is an American brand. I don't usually get this one. And it has omega 3s in it. I don't know when's the next time I'm gonna be able to get to Costco. So I didn't wanna to wait to get peanut butter and I've been dying for peanut butter and apples because apples are on sale right now. So you can get an apple for 100 yen, like one apple for a dollar. Usually it's like 150 yen or something like that. And then I like to use the same mascara all the time and the place around me stopped selling the mascara that I like and the mascara that I like is the Maybelline Magnum Volume Express, this one. I love this one, it's my jam. Every time people ask me what kind of mascara I'm using, 90% of the time it's this one, unless I run out and I cannot find this one because it's hard to find non-waterproof of this. And then I've been loving my Maybelline BB Cream that I've been using since like July. It's starting to run out and um, you can get it here in Japan. This is the BB Cream that I have been loving, the BB Cream Moist Matte. And it only comes in two colors in Japan, like one and two. So this is medium beige and I use this when I have fake tanner on. Clearly I haven't put fake tanner on in a really long time. I've been, you know, quite busy and stuff. So um, yeah, I guess I'm going to be trying the Super BB Ultra Cover BB, so it's gonna be a little bit different, but I did get it in fair. How can I open this? Yeah, so it looks different. It's a pink bottle. This one's blue. So I'm gonna try this one tomorrow. And then the last thing that I got is this brand. Um, this is a tonic water kind of thing for your skin, and it comes from soy milk. I use this brand's gel cream on my face for a really long time and a lot of people are asking me like um, my skincare routine, well that's like one part of it, the gel cream that I use from this brand, but I want to try to incorporate this if I can. Usually for me, the skincare that works best is simple is best. So I'm gonna try this out and if I feel like it starts breaking me out, I'm just gonna like not. It almost looks like a water. It feels super light. I'm gonna try that out tomorrow. Oh my god, I did it. The video is uploading. Woo! 
and it's like only 11.30, so I want to go to bed. But I wanted to say I had a really great time with Emily. We caught up, and I love Emily. She's so funny um, and so relatable. I just, I love hanging out with her. Thank you so much for watching this video. If you're liking Vlogtober and you're liking what I'm doing on this channel, be sure to give it a thumbs up, subscribe to my channel down below, all that jazz, and I'll see you guys tomorrow in the next video. Bye. Good night.